Hello peeps and welcome to the final disc in the Essential PlayStation series. This is Essential PlayStation CD12. 27 pieces of content, 25 of which are playable and 2 are movies, 14 of which are net yarose. Well, this one's a bit jam packed, isn't it? We're going to be here for quite some time. So, what we've got Metal Gear Solid, Legacy of Kane, Soul Reaver, Roll Cage, A Bug's Life, Cool Borders 3, Devil Dice, Wipeout 2097, Paul Shop, The Net Yarose Compilation, Gran Turismo, Metal Gear Solid Video, and Ridge Racer Type 4 Video. So, what we're going to do, we will go all this in order. And then we'll go to Gra we'll skip over Net Year Rose to Gran Turismo, watch the videos first, and then we'll do the Net Year Rose. So Net Year Rose will come at the end. So you'll see Gran Turismo and the videos first. Well, yeah, uh, I project this video is going to be around uh, probably around two hours long, maybe. Uh, we'll have to see. Um, but if not, probably not too far off. So, well. Let's get started. Metal Gear Solid. Good news as well, uh, if you didn't watch Demo 1 version 3, um, I have found Essential PlayStation uh, CD number 5 as part of the eBay listing. I am actively bidding on it right now. I'm hoping I win it, because then I can bring, hopefully, the, <laughs> the missing entry that people have been waiting for as early as next week, maybe. Um, that would be really, really cool. Um, We'll have to see. But, nonetheless, if I don't win the bid, um, I'll still actively look for it again. But, while I've got eyes on it, obviously I'm actively fighting for it. And, uh, yeah. About time too, eh? Nuclear weapons disposal facility on Shadow Moses Island in Alaska's Fox Archipelago was attacked and captured by next generation special forces being led by members of Foxhound. They're demanding that the government turn over the remains of Big Boss and they say that if their demands are not met within 24 hours, they'll launch a nuclear weapon. You'll have two mission objectives. First, you're to rescue DARPA Chief Donald Anderson and the president of Armstech, Kenneth Baker. Both are being held as hostages. Secondly, you're to investigate whether or not the terrorists have the ability to make a nuclear strike and stop them if they do. What's the insertion method? We'll approach the disposal facility by sub. And then... We'll launch a one-man SDV. After the SDV gets as close as it can, dispose of it. From there on, you'll have to swim. High-tech Special Forces Unit Foxhound. Your former unit, and one that I was a commander of. So they're still around. There are six members of Foxhound involved in this terrorist activity. Psycho Mattis, with his powerful psychic abilities. Sniper Wolf, a beautiful and deadly sharpshooter. Decoy Octopus, master of disguise. Vulcan Raven, giant and shaman. And Revolver Ocelot, specialist in interrogation and a formidable gunfighter. And finally, in charge of them, Foxhound squad leader, Liquid Snake. Liquid Snake? The man with the same code name as you. The nuclear weapons disposal facility covers the whole island. I'll instruct you by codec after you reach your target. 
Anyone going with me? As usual, this is a one-man infiltration mission. Weapons and equipment, OSP? Yes. This is a top-secret black op. Don't expect any official support. Okay. Go again. We've played this demo a few times now. This is Snake. Colonel, can you hear me? Loud and clear. What's the situation, Snake? Looks like the elevator in the back is the only way up. Just as I expected. You'll have to take the elevator to the surface. But make sure nobody sees you. If you need to, contact me by codec. The frequency is 140.85. When you want to use the codec, push the select button. When we need to contact you, the codec will beep. When you hear that noise, press the select button. The codex receiver directly stimulates the small bones of your ear. No one but you will be able to hear it. Got it. Okay, I'm ready to go. Let's do this. Shit. Waiting patiently.
come on, lift. There it is. It's Snake. I'm in front of the disposal facility. Excellent, Snake. Age hasn't slowed you down one bit. How's that sneaking suit working out? I'm nice and dry, but it's a little hard to move. Bear with it. It's designed to prevent hypothermia. This is Alaska, you know. Take it easy. I'm grateful. If it weren't for your suit and your shot, I would have turned into a popsicle out there. An anti-freezing peptide, Snake. All of the genome soldiers in this exercise are using it. I see. I'm relieved to hear that. Already tested, huh? By the way, how's the diversionary operation going? Two F-16s just took off from Galena and are headed your way. The terrorist radar should have already picked them up. Behind D? Colonel, what's a Russian gunship doing here? I have no idea. But it looks like our little diversion got their attention. Now's your best chance to slip in unnoticed. There goes the hind. There are only 18 hours left until their deadline. You've got to hurry. Wow, you must be crazy to fly a hind in this kind of weather. Who's that? Oh, sorry. I haven't introduced you two yet. This is Mei Ling. She was assigned to us as our visual and data processing specialist. She designed your codec, as well as your Soliton radar system. Contact her if you have any questions about either of them. <laughs> nice to meet you, Snake. It's an honor to speak to a, a living legend like yourself. What's wrong? Nothing. I just didn't expect a world-class designer of military technology to be so... Cute. <laughs> You're just flattering me. No, I'm serious. Well, I know I won't be bored for the next 18 hours. Come on. I can't believe I'm being hit on by the famous Solid Snake. But uh, I'm surprised. You're very frank for a trained killer. Looks like we both have a lot to learn about each other. Yeah. I'm Lots looking forward to learning about the man behind the legend. 
But first, let me explain about your Solitan radar system. The bright dot in the middle is you, Snake. The red dots are your enemies, and the blue cone shape represents their field of vision. Be careful, Snake. The genome soldiers have highly developed senses of hearing and vision due to their gene therapy. Make sure you don't let them see you. First, I want you to infiltrate the disposal site and look for the DARPA chief. The DARPA chief was injected with the same GPS transmitting nanomachines as you. He should appear on your radar as a green dot. Get whatever information you can from him about the terrorists. If he's alive, that is. Mm -hmm. Snake, your radar isn't affected by the weather, but if you're discovered by an enemy, you won't be able to use it. Yes, it gets jammed easily, I'm afraid. Yes, it's all made from currently existing technology. You won't be able to use it in an area with strong harmonic resonance, so be careful. We'll be monitoring your movements by radar, so contact us by codec anytime you want. Got it. I'll call if I'm feeling lonely. Seriously, Snake, we're here to back you up, so call if you need some information or advice. I'm also in charge of your mission data. Contact me if you want me to record your current status. My frequency is 140.96. It's a dedicated frequency for saving data. Don't forget it. Remember, except for your binoculars, you're naked. You need to arm yourself with whatever weapons you can find. I remember. First, I'm strip-searched by Dr. Naomi here, and then all my weapons are taken away. Imagine yourself put in that position. Well, if you make it back in one piece, maybe I'll let you do a strip-search on me. I'll hold you to that, Doctor. By the way, sorry to disappoint you, but I did manage to smuggle out my smokes. How did you do that? In my stomach. Thanks to the shot you gave me that suppressed my stomach acids. Cigarettes? How are those going to help you? You never know. If you want to get in, there's the front door. It's the fastest way, but there's too much risk of being spotted by the enemy. I can't just knock on the door and ask them to let me in. Uh, there's one sentry on the left and one on the right. They're armed with five five sixers and pineapples. What about the air duct near the door? There should also be a duct on the second floor. I can't see it from here. I'll let you decide the best COA. I'm counting on you, Snake. Okay, here we go. I'm not going to turn back, is it? A surveillance camera? base must have some kind of ventilation system to recirculate the air. There should be air ducts around there somewhere. They must need a lot of power to run the base. There's probably a diesel generator somewhere. And since generating electricity requires oxygen, there must be exhaust openings for that, too. You're not gonna believe this, but they shot down the F-16s we were using as a diversion with a Hein D. Then we got a message from Liquid. He said if we try something like that again, he'll launch the nuke. Snake, hurry up and get in there. That hind will be coming back soon. Mm-hmm. Pretty flawless.
Snake, this is McDonald Miller. It's been a long time. Master, what are you doing here? I quit being a drill instructor, so I moved out here for some peace and quiet. I'm in retirement, just like you. Once in a while, I still help train the Alaskan scouts. Passing on the skills to a new generation, huh? <laughs> Campbell told me about the situation here. I thought I might be of some use. There's no one I'd rather have in a foxhole than you. Well, I know lots about survival in a harsh environment. I've lived in Alaska longer than you. So call me if you have any questions about the flora or fauna out here. My frequency is 141.80. in the first floor basement. What about the vent shaft cleaning? They just opened the vent covers. They're about to start spraying for rats. First floor basement ventilation shaft. Shut those covers as soon as they're done spraying. Also, keep your eye on that woman in the cell. Don't get careless now. Woman in the cell? Going through the ventilation shop. Press the action button to drop down. Yep, gathered, but I'm going for that box really quickly. Oh. Oh, maybe I'm full. Okay, never mind. Okay. Actually, am I? Oh, yeah, I'm full. Okay. Use the elevator to change floors. There should be a cargo elevator that you can take down somewhere around there. Try to find it. Yep. Press 
Why didn't it not let me press a button for some reason? Go away! Not fair! Not fair! I didn't let me press the button for some damn reason. Use the elevator to change floors. There should be a cargo elevator that you can take down somewhere around there. Try to find it. Do it. Ah. Can you please work with me? There we go. No, I don't know what was going on there, but it wouldn't let me... Look at the radar. It's picking up the DARPA chief. He's the green dot. Hurry and rescue him. Oh, God, I don't know what was going on there. Sorry, but that was a bit of a, a nuisance. Snake, if you want to go up. Yeah, I know. Action button. There we go. Snake, the DARPA chief's signal is coming from somewhere in that area. Isn't there some place to drop down? Take a look around in first-person view mode. Donald Anderson, right? You here to save me, huh? What's your outfit? I'm the pawn they sent here to save your worthless butt. Really? It's true. 
You don't look like one of them. In that case, hurry up and get me out of here. Slow down. Don't worry. First, I want some information about the terrorists. The terrorists? Do they really have the ability to launch a nuke? What are you talking about? The terrorists are threatening the White House. They say if they don't accede to their demands, they'll launch a nuclear weapon. Sweet Jesus. Is it possible? It's possible. They could launch a nuke. Uh, what? How did they plan to launch? I thought this place was just for keeping the dismantled warheads. They shouldn't have access to a missile. What I'm about to tell you is classified information. Okay? We were conducting exercises with a new type of experimental weapon. A weapon that will change the world. What? A weapon with the ability to launch a nuclear attack from any place on the face of the Earth. A nuclear-equipped walking battle tank. Metal Gear... It can't be... You knew? Metal Gear is one of the most secret black projects. How did you know that? We've had a couple of run-ins in the past. So that's the reason you were here at this disposal site? Why else would I come to a godforsaken place like this? I had heard the Metal Gear project was scrapped. On the contrary. It's grown into a huge joint project between arms tech and ourselves. We were going to use this exercise as raw data, and then proceed to mass production. If it hadn't been for the revolution... Revolution? Rex has fallen into the hands of terrorists. Rex? Metal Gear Rex. The code name for the new Metal Gear prototype. Probably already finished arming the warhead they plan to use with Rex. These guys are pros. They're all experienced in handling and equipping weapons. Hey! Shut up in there, will ya? But I thought that all nuclear warheads were equipped with safety measures. Some kind of detonation code that you have to input. Oh, you mean PAL. Yes, of course, there is a PAL. It's set up so that you need to input two different passwords in order to launch the device. There are two passwords? Yes. Baker knows one, and I know one. Baker? The president of arms tech. That's right. <laughs> Each of us needs to input our password, or there can be no launch. But... they found out my password. You talked? Psychomantis can read people's minds. You can't resist. Psychomantis? One of the members of Foxhound. He has psychic powers. This is bad. It's just a matter of time before they get Baker's too. If they find out Baker's password... Yes, they'll be able to launch a nuke any time. But there is a way to stop the launch. What? The card keys. Card keys? They were designed by Armstead, the system developers, as an emergency override. Even without the passwords, you can just insert the card keys and engage the safety lock. And if I do that? Yes. You can stop the launch. That card key. So where are the keys? Baker should have them. Listen, you need three card keys. There are three different slots to put them in. You need to insert a card into each one of them. Okay, three card keys. Do you know where they might be keeping Baker? Somewhere in the second floor basement. Second floor basement? I heard the guards say they moved him to an area that has a lot of electronic jamming. Any other clues? Yes. They cemented over the entrances, but didn't have enough time to paint them. Why don't you look for the areas where the walls are a different color? 
Here, take this. It's my ID card. It'll open any level one security door. It's called a pan card. It works together with your body's own electrical field. Personal area network, huh? It transmits data using the salts in your body as the transmission medium. As you approach the door's security devices, they'll read the data stored in the card. And the doors will open automatically. Gotcha. Okay, I'm gonna get you out of here. Wait a minute. What is it? You haven't heard any other way to disarm the pal, have you? From your bosses or anyone? No. Are you sure you haven't heard anything? I just said no. So does the White House plan to give in to the terrorists' demands? That's their problem. It has nothing to do with my orders. But what about the Pentagon? Pentagon? What is it? Dead. Uh, dead. And there you go, that is the end of the demo. Start select. All right. Let's move on. Finally. 38 minutes almost later. Legacy of Cain, Soul Reaver. Oh, this might be the short demo, hang on. Oh. Yeah, it's a short one. Okay. Well, this one, I thought this one was going to be like the long one. You know, this one's like a few minutes long at max. Uh, oh, right, um, I'm going to check the controls. Right, here we go. Um, crouch and X for high jump, okay. That's the only reason I went back to the main menu, I wanted to check. I remember you had to do a high jump, and I uh, couldn't remember how you do it. There we go. No! Crap. No, don't start failing now, Ben. Right. Oh. There we 
There we go. And that is the end of the demo. Literally. <laughs> well, this is the short one. Okay, next up, Roll Cage. We haven't played this one for quite some time. Oh, it was a reset. Yay. Is it this pole shot music? Is this a race? It is. Crappy craft here. Going the wrong way constantly. Well done. You 
came third somehow. It was all over the place. Oh god. And we had all the grip in the world as well. Oh wow, okay. Alright then. If that's what you call grip, then I don't know <laughs> know what to say. <laughs> When you don't play a game for so long as well, I haven't played Roll Cage since, I don't even know, God. It's been quite some time. Alright, next up was A Bug's Life. Will this work this time? Because this didn't work last time. Now, so we've done a reset, so if it doesn't work the first time, then we know it doesn't work. Okay. Looks like it's working to me so far. Hey, it works! Alright. Oh. <sighs> Ant Island. This way, quick! Well, isn't this nice? Gotta get to the anthill. Gotta get to the anthill. Yes, I know. Ah, the life of an ant. Oh. What a beautiful day in my neighborhood. Oh, come on! This I can use. And the day started off so nicely. There is something up there, and I can't seem to get it. Gotta get to the anthill. Okay, well. That could be useful. <sighs> Ant Island. Gotcha. Did well, I... isn't this nice? Did I just pull off some trick shot there? Oh no, I didn't. 
Why do you say got here then? Ah, the life of an ant. Started off so nicely. Oh, yeah. This <sighs> Fresh oil. Over here. What a beautiful day in my neighborhood. This nice. <gasps> that helps. <gasps> Gotta get to the ant. <gasps> that helps. <gasps> ah, the life of an ant. Here we get it, mate. <laughs> what a beautiful day in my neighborhood. Yours. <sighs> nice one. Super fairy. The day started off so nicely. Gotta get to the this I can use. <sighs> Ant Island. Oh, yeah. <laughs> we got to the end hill. Okay, that was a bug's life. Nearly an hour, uh, coming up to an hour in, almost. 53 and a half minutes right now. Next up, Cure Borders Free. Another game which I'm obviously going to suck at.
weapon there. No. Am I second place right now? Shit. Oh, well, okay. For some reason I didn't get to the trick there, but that's fine. No! No, 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 no. I don't want to finish last. Oh, what? No! No, I won't have this. This is not fair. Well, yeah. It's not too bad, is it? Ugh. So sad. Never mind. Next up, Devil Dice. A game we have played before. As well, multiple times. Okay, Devil Dice. Uh, we'll do the three minute one. It's hard, this though. Struggling a little bit here. Can't seem to get.
Not the knife. Let's play the puzzle. I'll do this one again. No. Brains up with it today. Okay, next up, Wipeout 2097. Yes. Back once again. <laughs> okay, I'll we'll start. In we go again. All right. Get our Kyrex out. And start straight away. Uh, we will do one race on Vector and one race on Rapier. We're not going to do the glitch because it just takes, <laughs> it just adds unnecessary time to the video. So, you know. Obviously, it's already getting long enough as it is, and obviously, we've still got all of the net Yorose games to go. Mark 
pocket. Missile rocket. Rocket. A bit too close to the wall there. Don't really make that mistake often. <sighs> Done it again. Jeez. Let's go back to the main menu and do rapier. Oh, really? Why did you do that? Bloody demo mode. Why do, I don't know why it does that sometimes. It's very weird. I'm so used to playing Wipeout Free. <laughs> There you go. Could be worse. Start select. All right.
next up, Pool Shark. A game that I also haven't played in a long time. Oh, okay. Mirage! Limited free ball them. Oh, God, yeah. This is the one where you only get free balls, isn't it? <laughs> oh, no. We're going against Ed Case. Free balls. <laughs> Here we go. Oh. <laughs> I didn't really aim it, I just decided to smash it. <laughs> Well done. Yeah. Well done. Wow. We hope you enjoy playing this demo. Was there really much to enjoy? Blimey. <laughs> uh. Should we have another go, just for a laugh? Oh, screw it. Let's do it. Let's do it one more time, just for the gags. All right, <laughs> one more go, and then we'll have to move on. <laughs> right, start. Quick start. Easy. Yeah. Right, here we go. Maximum power, just to, you know, get it all started off. I've got one. What?! What?! Why did it just end?! What?! Did I win? Or something? Oh, okay. Um, Alright, then I guess we won't play it again. Jeez. Alright. <laughs> I'll see how it is. Alright. Grand Trismo. What the fuck? Alright. That's funny. Oh, goodness gracious. I 
I think it's going to put me into a replay, isn't it? Arcade. Let's get a Okay, here we go. It's annoying when you don't really get a chance to uh, do the whole race. It's really sad. Just going to start select. There we go. Yours. And I think we are done with the playable content, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, we are. So we're on to Metal Gear Solid video. And then once we've done the videos, we will go on to the Met Your Rose collection.
There you go. Da -dum. All right, moving on. Ridge Racing Type Four video. And that is Ridge Racer Site 4. Dun, da, da, da. Kill. By Namco. And there we are. That is all of the main content on the disc. Now we move on to Net Eurose. Here we go, Net Eurose compilation. Let's see what we got. Okay, we have Total Soccer, Eurose, Blitter Boy, Ma Yong, Haunted Maze, Pushy 2, Psycon, Hovercar Racing, Gravitation, Rocks and Gems, of course. The, oh, yes, the Incredible Coma Man, Terra Incognita, Bouncer 2, Clone. And between the eyes. All right, let's get started. Total Soccer Eurose. Uh, for each game, we will do either a couple of levels or maximum five minutes. Will be Wumble done. Oh.
Oh, I'll, I'll, I'll get to select, don't I? Uh, then. Okay. Oh. oh, God, who am I? Uh, done. Yeah, I know I'm Wimbledon, but I need to. Oh, no, stop. Yeah, go. Stop. Yeah, start. No! Hang on. Why does it always do this? Replays. Oh. Oh, okay. Oh, there you go. Oh, no more button pressing, I think. Okay, well, we drew nil nil. Start to select. Move on to Glitter Boy. We will play two levels. How does that sound? I think that's reasonable. Nice work, kid. Ready to go again? Well, of course. Oh, <laughs> 
Oh no no no! Mission aborted. Game over. Oh well. Uh, all right, we'll move on. Ma Yong. This one I'll make an exclusion. Uh, we'll try and beat it. Um, as I've not played it for a while. We'll try and beat it, shall we? Mm -hmm. Okay, here we go. Right. There are ten moves currently. Just trying to remember how we do this. Uh, okay, I see one. Okay. Has been a little, excuse me, a little waho. There's ten moves here apparently, and I can't see them. If you can get rid of that free, that'd be great. Ah, uh, oh shit. Um. No. Oh. Um, okay. It'll come back to me in a minute. Ten moves. Still on the board. Where's he going? There. There we go. Oh, I can't do that. Get rid of that one, that'd be fantastic because I can get rid of the top bit there. Mm. There's seven moves out there. <sighs> that's not playable, that's not playable, that's not playable. There was an E somewhere, wasn't there? Oh yeah. Hmm. Oh yeah, I can't do that. Um, can't do that. I can. Oh, 
There, can I do that? Oh, I can. Is that no? Now it's play, it's playable. Okay. Two sixes there. Oh, there's a six there as well. Yeah, get rid of that. Um, and eight. Yeah, nice. to get to there. New. Um, we need to get rid of that top one. That's what I need to do. There we go. see a move at the minute. I know there's three moves out there. I can't see it currently. Um, I 
Oh, C1. This could render a problem, couldn't it? Shit, one move. Oh. Oh, no, I think I'm going to lose. Get rid of that five, that'd be great. But really, I do need to get rid of that south. Um, hmm. Oh, wait. This could be a loser. I see one move left. Oh, still holding off. to go. No. Did quite well there as well. Haunted maze.
Yeah, nice. Oh, oh, I got caught. Okay. We'll do this one and then we'll move on. Oh shit. Never mind. Okay. Lovely. Alright. Moving on. Push you two. Because it is looking like this video will exceed two hours. <laughs> but hey. Doesn't matter. that doesn't it I'm going to leave it there um, and move on. Saiken.
Oh, I'm dead. Oh, never mind. I'm alive. And now I can run. Hold square and you can run. Where do we go? back to the main menu on that one then. Excellent. Next up, hover car racing. Let's do Arcade Championship. B. We will be red. Okay. Hmm. Okay. Okay, we'll leave it at that. Done a race, so you've seen what it's like. Pretty cool. Okay, Gravitation, another racing game. Let's do a map we've not played yet. If I can remember which ones I have played and haven't played. Loading grab. Grab. Av. Vit. Tate. Shun. That doesn't know that we play one. Race. Yeah, that can be played this one, yeah. Oh.
になるあーあーどうぞあーサイクこれ、これ、これ、これ、これ、これ、これ、これ、これ、これ、これ、これ、これ、これ、これ、これ、これ、これ、これ、これ、これ、これ、これ、これ、これ、これ、これ、これ、これ、これ、これ、これ、これ、これ、これ、これ、これ、これ、これ、これ、これ、これ、これ、これ、これ、これ、これ、これ、これ、これ、これ、これ、これ、これ、これ、Maybe we might be able to win. Well, hello. Oh, okay. Fucking hell, that made me jump. <laughs> oh my god. So, how does this make the game easier exactly? Because. No, I don't get it. No, no, I was doing all right there. Last go. I really don't get it. Sometimes rocks fall, sometimes they don't fall.
get the rave music ready. Never mind. I do love that game, though. Know, it's, it's it's funny. How many we got left? Uh, we got four left. Okay. Uh, Terra Incognita. Um, we will play this for five minutes at most, just because this one is a large game. The treasure is protected by a horrible monster. <laughs> I love his head when he moves. I am really, really scary.
Okay, here we go. Heart, lovely. Attack him. Thank you. Oh shit! Oh, that's not what I wanted to do. Oh, I'll screw it. <laughs> I threw that box away. <laughs> oh damn it! That's not what I wanted to do. Never mind. Okay, bounce to two. Two hours, thirteen minutes right now.
Holy shit. It's taking a while, isn't it? Oh, what? Oh, I'm gonna have another go. We'll move on. That's bound to two for you. Okay, got clone in between the eyes. We will go clone. We will only do the first level of clone because the video is getting very long. And, uh, yeah. Benno is getting tired.
Okay, and that is clone for you. Finally, between the eyes. Last thing on the disc. I'm going to turn the light on very quickly. I can't see. Track 17. Spy plane. Five drivers. Three laps. Oh, nice, I won the race out. Oh, no, no, no. Uh, let's do track 25. Oh, this is like... My God. Sickness simulator. Fuck. Won the race outright, yay. We'll do one more. 36. Oh god, it can go up and down. Okay, no, I can do that. Seven. Stay the fucking thing. Ah. Shit. Oh, well, there you go. I'll leave it at that.
because that's hurting my eyes. <laughs> okay. And that was uh, Essential PlayStation CD12. And that was the Essential PlayStation demo series. Okay, we're obviously missing f no, number five at the minute at this moment in time. But obviously, as I mentioned at the start, um, I've obviously got a bid, a bid on, on at the moment on eBay for it in hopes that I win. If I do win it, then you will hopefully get uh, Essential PlayStation Demo CD5 on, well, I believe probably this time next week. So, if, oh, it is hoping anyway. Um, if you don't see it, then presume I lost the bid or it's delayed or something. I don't know. I'll let you guys know on the community tab what happens. But either way, Thank you very much for watching. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed the series. Uh, it's been fun. And, uh, yeah. Until next time, uh, cheerio.